don't hurt Zero anymore. <laughs> you can't stand seeing people get hurt, can you, X? You can take the pain that I inflict on you, but Zero's pain hurts you more, doesn't it? I'll take your cherished Zero. We'll all go to hell together. <laughs> Farewell, X! <laughs> Bye. Sigma! Son of a bitch! What's up guys, this is Mike from Race Break Gaming, and it is time to bring the fight to Sigma. Well, let's play Mega Man X5, Improvement Project Addendum. Well, viewers, we have reached the end of X's path in this playthrough, so yeah, let's end it off on a high note. Now, um, assuming you're using X's ultimate armor, which you probably really should be for the final, at least for the final stages anyway, um, make sure to equip, um, well, here's my best setup for X, since he can only use two slots in his, um, ultimate armor. Basically, equip him with the ultimate buster, so that way you can fire fully charged buster shots, as well as buster plus, which increases the strength of X's buster shots. So yeah, those will be very, very useful. Now, if Buster Plus is not something you want to have on, um, I recommend having Ultimate Buster with um, Hyper Dash, which will be even better. Or, if you don't want Ultimate Buster or Buster Plus at all, for some fucking reason, Super Recover and Hyper Dash. That's my best um, setup for X. So for now, it is time to bring the fight to Sigma. Are you ready? Cool. Let's do it. And oh yeah, don't forget to go to Spiral Pegasus' level to refill up your sub tanks and stuff before we go. Because once you do, it's we're going right to the end now. So let's get going. The final Zero Space stage. Do it! What the fuck is this music? <laughs> Did I just step into a rave? Viewers, viewers, wait, 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 wait. I gotta hear this. Oh my gosh! <laughs> that is fucking awesome! But in any case, yeah, we got some old um, frenemies from the previous um, Maverick stages here. Yay. <laughs> These fucking fish. Whatever, I'm gonna fry your ass! There you go, careful. Watch the roly polies. There you go. Get bitches out of here! And boom shakalaka! <laughs> ha -ha! Oh, not these fuckers too! Ugh! There you go. Nova Strike is so good. Oh, okay. Watch this. Careful. Bra Watch me die! <laughs> no, no, no. But yeah, I, I totally did that stupidly wrong. So yeah, okay. Fuck the fish. We're wasting time, so let's get moving. Ow. Ow. Gotta, gotta really watch your jumps, it seems. Bruh. It's like, it's like I just stepped into Bubble Man's level from Mega Man 2. It's crazy. Alright, wait for it. Ah! Yeah! <laughs> fucking game squid! Okay. Calm down. This switches the fucking screen on me like that. Rude! In the case. Ah! If only the ultimate buster had the means of ah! oh! Fucking A! Ah! Oh! Holy Arceus! <laughs> that was close! I think I missed it, but if you go all the way to the, the um the top right over here, well before you fall down here to the boss gates, um yeah, I think there'll be like a full health bar or something like that, or a full life capsule. Whatever. In any case, we got the Mavericks again, just like before in every game. In any case, first up, Title Whale! It's time for a boss fight! Not that it matters, because Title Whale is going down. We don't really have to be going through any of this shit Ugh! anymore, because we already know how this is going to end. Just watch out for the spikes, obviously. But luckily, with the ultimate, um buster and stuff, I could just use the fully charged attacks with no issues. Now, that might become a problem in, in the Sigma fight, though. Since he has one particular weakness, 
but the charged version of it is complete ass. Ah! Back to Red Lobster, bitch. <laughs> Does Red Lobster eat? Ha is whale even a thing to eat? I never even considered that. Is whale even safe to eat? Or is it inhu- oh, No, that's not- That's not inhumane. That, is it fair to the whales? But then again, we- We kill crabs and eat crabs and shit. So, uh, I guess- You know what? Fuck it. Whatever. Questions for later. Let's do it! In the case! Now, here's the thing. Crescent Grizzly, when we first fought him before, his weakness we did not have. His weakness, of course, being the spike ball from Axel the Red. Or, sorry, Spike Arrows Red, though. So, there you go. Okay. Come on, big guy! Give me a beer hug! <laughs> oh, big ass teddy bear. Me personally, I wouldn't take this level of disrespect. <laughs> Come on, you big ass Ursa Ring! God? Don't you got stat bonus? Like shit, what are you doing, bro? Ah! Fuck off! Back to the forest, Yogi. <laughs> oh, I'm having a ball. This music just makes me so fucking happy. It just, it, this is probably one of the best final stage themes in the X series so far. So far, X X Six's final stage level things pr is pretty good, pretty sinister and dank. But you know, I love it. X Five has some great fucking music. Besides, you know, the stages, the ball scene, which is sexy, and then ah, you got the final stage music. Just wait till we get to the Sigma fight. You're gonna love it. In any case, watch that whip. <laughs> yeah, I'm not wasting time with these fuckers. We already fought them already. So I have no qualms about using the Nova Strike. So yeah, oof. I honestly don't give a shit at this point. We're at the end. I gave you the tutorial shit for when we fought them the first time. Now it's time to go for broke. Now, Spino Pegasus Soul. Ah! This time, your Millennium Eye will not work, bro. I'm gonna have to try a different tactic. Yeah. <laughs> I have such a good time with the fucking Nova Strike. Woo! Come on! <laughs> yeah. Was that it? I'm disappointed. striking the bastard in the crotch with my buster. It seems it seems I've been doing that a lot lately in my Mega Man playthroughs. It always ends up hitting them in the dick. That's not my intention, but I mean they put themselves in that fucking position. Blame them. Not me. You don't shoot a guy in the dick. Who does that? Just don't. In the case. I'm thinking of course of that South Park episode. <sighs> Cartman and Butters, man. I, I, no, no. Cartman does Butters so dirty, and yet, at this point, Butters is pretty much, or Cartman, or, no, 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 no. I think Butters is really Cartman's best friend at this point. Because you see how, um, you know, our, you know, Stan, Kyle, and Kenny treat Cartman sometimes. Even though Cartman technically deserves it. But Butters, Butters is a good guy. So yeah, we all rock with brother, uh, brothers. <laughs> we all rock with butters. So there you go. All the homies love butters. He's a cool dude. That being said, ugh, time to get this show finished. Who's next? Who? 
Dr. Firefly. How's it going? Time to turn out your nightlight. <laughs> now, come on! Turn to turn that nightlight off. And shove my Nova Strike up that Firefly ass. Come on, dog. C come on, dog. You gotta do a little better than that. Your butt lasers aren't working! Got a bit faster than that! Woo! Ha! Oh, bitch! You're getting annoying! What's this? Nothing! <laughs> Bye! Damn. Boss rushes in the later X games are so fun. I'm not talking about X7, though, because X7's boss rush at the end before Sigma. You guys remember when I did my X7 LP, how shitty that boss rush was? Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! Oh, God. Fuck that boss, and fuck the person that came up with it. Like, seriously, fucking Flame Hynard, I, I, I think his name was. Yeah, not the best fire doggo. Very bad fire doggo. Yeah. You just gotta know how to really kick his ass. Which is a shame that the ultimate armor and all that other good shit doesn't exist in X7. Instead, all we get is, well, Axel and X's shitty ass glide armor, which is complete ass. <laughs> it's, it's pretty much a bootleg, it's pretty much a bootleg ultimate armor, except without the added benefits. And with no Nova Strike either, so. X7 is, X, uh, I'm not gonna say X7 is completely shit and stuff like that because X7 has its quirks. X7 has some sexy music to it too, just like most, all the other X games. Even X6, which is, well, not as bad as X7 and stuff like that. The music in X6 is sexy as hell. And, oh my god, man. X7 has its quirks. It has really bad ones. Like Alia. And, um, well, I want to say Axel, but no, because Axel's cool. He's pretty much a replacement X, but, you know, not all pussy and shit. Come on! Ah! But, yeah, ever since, I don't know why, but ever since this game in particular, eh, no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, ever since this game, X, X has become somewhat of a pussy. Somewhat. I mean, yeah, he's still willing to fight, but then it gets so much to the point that once you get to X7, X is all like, fuck this shit. I'm out, bro. I'm out. I can't take it no more. Instead, he leaves all the fighting to Zero. I mean, then again, technically, he does, he does this in the Zero series to an extent, but that one is understandable. But for the X series games right at the moment, nah, nah. It's understandable in the Zero series, considering what the fuck happens and stuff. But there's no excuse. Like, seriously, you know what your job is, X. You're a fucking Maverick Hunter. What the fuck are these? Ah! Whoa, shit, whoa! Woo! Disappearing blocks? Oh, this is a reference to those disappearing blocks from the classic series. How can I not figure that out sooner? Oh, right, no! No! Okay, that was dumb! Let's try that again, shall we? Alright, let's try this again, shall we? With less fail this time. Oh my gosh. This part never gave me trouble until now. I did, you just have to time your jumps correctly. Ah, yes! Woo! Holy shit. There's no excuse why I would fail that for X. With Zero is another story, maybe. But X, come on, bro. What the fuck is this background? It looks like I'm inside a fucking graphics card. Interesting. Well, final boss time. Be right back. All right, viewers of Mac, ready? Let's do this. What the fuck? What the fuck's with this area here? Uh, Sigma. Sigma has wings? Or is that a cape? It looks kind of cool, though. <laughs> well done, X. The ultimate reploid. You came much earlier than I expected. Yeah, well, you sent trash my way I was easily able to dispose of. What do you expect? 
But what did you do all this for? What was the point? Because of Zero. To awaken Zero from his false self. What? Over the years, I've done all sorts of research on the two of you and learned of a magnificent truth. I wanted to see Zero's true form more than anything. So I spread the virus across the world to purify his body. However, that wasn't enough. So I took that old colony and turned it into a virus colony and let it fall to the earth. The result was exactly as I predicted. Really, nigga? You son of a bitch! So you did all this for something so petty? The earth was almost destroyed! Including you in the process. You know that, right? No matter how invincible you you think you are, that you could just possess other people's bodies and shit, eventually you're going to die if the whole planet dies. You know that, right? <sighs> Whatever. Fortunately, there was a group of slackers called the Maverick Hunters, which I was a part of back in the day, <coughs> that managed to prevent the world's destruction. But alas, most of the Hunters have also become Mavericks. <laughs> That was a close call, wasn't it, Axe? <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you, then! Damn you, Sigma! I've lost so many friends because of you. I will not stand for it! I'll never forgive you. I will make you pay for what you've done, Sigma. <laughs> Try your best, then, because your life depends on it, X. Fine. It's time for a boss fight! Versus Sigma! First form! In any case, I'm not holding any bars against Sigma, so it's time to finish this. Like, literally. Uh, oh! Uh, oh! <laughs> Come on, Sigma! Woo! What the hell? Whoa! Oh! Uh, careful! Uh, uh, gotcha, bitch! What? <laughs> It wouldn't be a Mega Man X game without having a second form. Where are you, Sigma? <laughs> you really are the best X. The stronger you are, the more I want to destroy you. That sounds oddly sexual. But, but, but not in the same context, but whatever. I couldn't even do I couldn't even do it after making you and Zero fight each other. Oh my gosh. You're the best, friend, foe. You'll fight anyone. Shut the fuck up, scum. Where are you? I'm right here. NANI? Ah! Where the fuck did that come from? I didn't even see that there! <laughs> here I am. I have no intention of running or hiding. The truth is, this time I had quite the good partner. Yeah, unlike Vile and or Dr. Dobbler or even those shitty fools at the Rebel Force. <laughs> nah. Or even the X Hunters who were a complete ass too. But yeah, he supported me in many ways. Apparently in the past, he created an endless amount of robots and presented me with the body that I reveal to you now. Who is your supposed partner? You arrived rather early, so it's not quite complete, but it should be more than enough. <laughs> he was he is a reliable partner. No, friend. He was more but he was more obsessed with you than anyone I've ever seen. He was truly dependable. It was nice knowing that there was someone who hates you as much as I do. Now feel our combined rage! Die, X. <laughs> the only one that's dying here is you, Sigma. It's time for the final boss fight! Versus Gamma Sigma! Uh oh! Which we'll need to be careful of, because he is- Oh, shit! Sub tank? Yeah, he is a bit more dangerous this time around. Unlike that shitty ass battle body he had in the in, in the third game. So yeah, this time he means business. So yeah, watch out for the arms, don't get crushed. Which can de uh, yeah, definitely happen. Some odd reason I can actually walk through the arms. I don't know how that works, but alright. Come on, Sigma! Really? You're using electric spark tactics again? Didn't you do this shit in X2? Try a new tactic, bruh. This one isn't working for you! By the way, Sigma's last form here is weak to the spike ball. Whoa! What the fuck are these? Oh! Uh, 
the oh shit. Move! Who? What the fuck was that? Ow! Ew! Oh! So tank! It's my last one. If I fuck it, if I fuck it up now, I'm done. Shit. Oh! Oh shit! Whoa! Careful! Come on! I'm gonna kick your ass, Sigma! Cherish Zero. We'll all go to hell together. <laughs> Farewell, X! <laughs> Bye. Sigma! Son of a bitch! <sighs> what now? to rest and relax for now. Hold on, X. Just for a few more moments. Dr. Light? The hell was that? Three years later. A giant map has appeared at the Horde 2146 block area. Go into action immediately. Roger. I'm heading out. Keep your wits about you, everyone. We'll be, we've been used to living in peace. Since that day, Captain X's eyes have become more stern and sharp as that other one. I'll face any enemy now, as long as I have this, Saber. I'll fight today too. Zero, we'll fight together. We'll be together forever. Zero. So Zero, Zero did die. Or was this retconned? Hmm, interesting. Well, we'll have to see X6 for that, because, yeah. I'm not going to spoil it yet, but you'll probably, you know, forget it. And then, <laughs> well, Mega Man X5 has wrapped up. Improve I gotta say, Improvement Project Addendum was one of the best versions of X5 I have ever played in my life. Let me get started on my in-game review. I'll be doing two in-game reviews, because I'll be starting Zero's Path next um, in tomorrow's episode. So, yeah, it'll continue, um, X5 Addendum will continue with Zero's Path tomorrow. So, yeah, as far as X's Path are concerned, as far as difficulty, I'm going to be giving Nads a 7 out of 10. Game wasn't that difficult, even on extreme mode. You just have to know what the fuck you're doing and stuff like that. But, yeah, most of the, the things that we dealt with in either version 
it's still the same regardless of difficulty, so it's not that big a deal. As far as the plot is concerned, I'm going to be giving that a definite 8 out of 10. Now, the plot was good. We found out at the very end what Sigma's goal was, but at the same time, I kind of wish that was sprinkled out a bit more throughout the course of the game. Besides just trying to hurry up and find find a way to destroy the damn colony and shit like that. We could have found out more, like had a se separate cutscene with Sigma. Or had more interaction with Dynamo, you know what I mean? Like, have Dynamo and Sigma talk some more. Like, after we defeat Dynamo the second time, there should be some dialogue between him and Sigma saying, Oh, Sigma, I, I, I've, I'm calling it quiz for now, bro. Thanks, but I'm out of here. I'll see you in X6. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I, it, it is what it is. As far as the gameplay, gameplay is a 10 out of 10. Improvement Project Addendum did so so many things better. The fact that whenever you get KO, your special weapons energy will recharge. As, as well as, you know, placing all the, um, all, all the other things that just made it so special, you know? I can't even begin to list them all. I mean, there's new things that can break different obstacles and stuff like that. The fact that they added the opening and ending Japanese themes and stuff like that. X's good ending here, which we're hearing now, is called Armageddon and stuff like that. It's just really good. They restored X-Zero and Dynamo's voice clips and stuff. Restored the Maverick introduction name calls from X-4 and stuff like that. Stage modifications. Tidal well stage thing was amazing. And the fact you could use armors even though they're incomplete shows just how great the person that made this version is. They really know this game in and out to the point that they can adjust it to make it look really, really more balanced than the OG, so I love it. And also the fact that Alias hints can be turned the fuck off. That was the biggest, that was the biggest 10 out of 10. As far as the music, 10 out of 10. I mean, you got the Japanese opening and ending things playing and stuff like that. Beautiful. Um, as far as the game overall, I will give Mega Man X5 Improvement Project Addendum, X's Path, that is. I'm going to be giving that a definite 9 out of 10. It was a beautiful run. I mean, having the ultimate armor at the very beginning just makes the game more fun for me. I don't know about you viewers, but every time I play X5 or X4 or X6, whichever, I always go for that first. Because that is, it just makes the it just makes the game so much more fun for me. Yeah, I was chasing the bosses at the end there, but we fought them before, so who gives a shit, right? <laughs> but guys, thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoy, you know what to do, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for giving me videos for me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell to notify my newest uploads. Got something to say? Of course you do. Leave a comment. Sorry about that, viewers. <laughs> but yeah, signing on to my next Let's Play. I'll be starting my um, Mega Man X5 Improvement Project Addendum Zero's Path. I'll be starting that tomorrow. So yeah, we'll be going through X5 again. But this time, as Zero. And trust me, it's going to be fucking amazing. How will I fare with Zero's sexy dank armor going through the stages oh we're gonna have a blast so i hope you guys enjoy so yeah thanks for watching you guys thanks for watching guys have a great day my bitches and bros smile you later <laughs>